all Britney fans, there's some good news on the horizon. And let's do the Time Lord again. It's all in the showbiz hot five, so let's kick off with five. Plan B didn't work out, so Jennifer Aniston's moved on to Plan C. Plan B was of course the name of her production company with ex Brad Pitt. Well, she started another one, it's called Echo Films, and already has loads of projects in the pipeline. All featuring Jen, of course. I guess that's one way to make sure you're never out of work. In at four, she's been blessed with the ability to sing, but Mariah Carey was clearly way at the back of the queue when they were handing out the math skills. Everyone's favourite diva has called her new album E equals MC squared. But unlike Einstein, who came up with the formula, she has no head for numbers. If you asked me to like do anything other than add like single digit moments, it would be a wouldn't be, it would be like an Excedrin moment, it's too much, and that's why it's sort of, we're, we're laughing here, we're clearly taking the, you know what. Yeah Mimi, that's exactly what they call them, moments. Next up at three, who the daddy? Oh really, who, as in Doctor Who? It's amazing, and it's back in full force. Prepare to be blown away by the fourth series, which is heading to a screen near you. But contrary to reports, it won't be featuring a certain beehive singer, according to Time Lord David Tennant. I'm a huge fan of Amy Winehouse, and, uh, and I'd be very happy if she was in the show. But as we filmed the last episode, and she wasn't in it, that might be a clue. Add two, Britney Spears has rekindled an old relationship. But no, it's not the one you're thinking. It's reported the star has hooked up again with her old manager, Larry Rudolph. He's the man often said to have been behind her massive career. So let's just hope he helps her get back on the right track. And wait for it, wait for it, it's your top story at one. Now, if you thought Jordan and Peter's wedding was bling-tastic, well, you ain't seen nothing yet. These two could be about to show them how it's done. Tabloids in the States claim Beyonce and rapper boyfriend Jay-Z are finally about to tie the knot. It's after they took out a marriage license. Now, the document is valid for around 60 days. So watch this space. While I'm off to buy a new hat, well, you never know, I might get an invite. I'll see you lot later.